If you're asked to draw the molecular structure for 2-ethyl pentane, you might draw something like this. You have pentane, that means you have 5, and it's an alkane, all single bonds. So you draw 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then on the second one, you could put an ethyl group. That's these two carbons here. The problem is that when we say the longest chain is pentane, the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, there's an actually a little bit longer chain we can have here. If we start here, we could go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So the longest chain really is hexane. We have six carbons. So for that reason, when we name this, we shouldn't call it 2-ethyl pentane. We should call it 1, 2, so there's the 3, 3, methyl. And then we have six carbons in the chain, so it should be hexane. So the correct name for this structure isn't 2-ethyl pentane, it's 3 methyl hexane. And that's because the longest chain is actually 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 carbons. This is Dr. B with the structure for 2-ethyl pentane, which really is 3 methyl hexane. Thanks for watching.